Hey girl, hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do the Dollar Tree Slime Challenge. I have been wanting to do this video for quite some time now. My friend Abraham from DIYs by Abraham created this challenge and he tagged me like literally eight months ago, I think. I bought a lot of stuff. They literally have everything to make slime. I spent $50 and I actually went crazy. I got so much glue and so much everything, enough to make slime for a while. But before we get started, I want to thank Audible for sponsoring this video. If you do not know what Audible is, it is digital spoken audio. So it reads to you instead of you reading the story. So you are the listener. I personally don't like reading, but I also love hearing a good story. So this is convenient for me. Also with Audible, I feel like it just makes it so much easier to get books in my life. I mean, I literally just click listen. It's in your hands, basically. So if you're someone like me who likes a good story, you just don't like reading. Actually, no. Even if you love reading and you're just really busy, this is perfect for you. If you're always on the road, you can literally listen to you in your car if you're a busy person in general or if you love reading or even if you don't love reading but you love a good story then this is for you audible is hands down the leading provider of digital spoken audio they have an unbeatable selection of audiobooks i recently listened to wonder by rj palacio it's about a little boy who is born different it's a really inspirational book and i would recommend it if you're new to audible i would definitely recommend this book so Audible is kind enough to offer you guys a free 30-day trial if you guys sign up right now with audible.com slash Karina. That is audible.com slash Karina. The really cool thing is when you sign up with Audible, you get to keep a free book. And even if you continue with a service or you decide that you don't want to continue with it, you still get to keep your free book. So you have nothing to lose. I'm going to go ahead and link Audible at the very top of my description box. So go click the link down below. Okay, so I got so much stuff at the Dollar Tree. Let's get straight into this video. Let me show you a haul of what I got. So I got some styrofoam beads. I got two different sizes. I also got some pom-poms. I got some paint. I also found these cool little containers. This is like all one dollar, so I thought it was amazing. Some googly eyes. Some buttons. I got this. This is also like Christmas related, but I thought this would look so pretty. I also got some silly string. This is a goofy string, like the knockoff. I don't know. I thought this would make really cool, like fluffy slime. I also got way more like little confetti things. I also got some sand. Got some lotion. Some baby oil. Oil, some spoons and also some craft sticks for mixing and stuff. I don't know why I bought these I got them as the like mixing bowls and now that I think about it There were so many different sizes why I chose these I'm not really sure but I guess it's to make like a decent size I got some glitter some glitter glue because this is literally all of the clear slime they had This is the closest to clear it came. So I got this more add-ins. I got some diapers I got some baby powder. We got some air wick and I got so much glue, you guys. I kind of went ham with it. And we got some Tide. This is gonna be the main activator. Some air dry clay. I got some candles for candle slime. And these are scented, amazing, like Skittles. And they also had scents. Some shaving cream that smells like raspberries. The first one we're gonna do is try to make some fluffy slime. I thought I would try a different shaving cream because this one smells good. And some Tide and our mixing bowls. So I'm gonna try these mixing bowls. I feel like they're a little bit small so we're just gonna go in with our glue it smells just like Elmer's go in with our shaving cream oh I thought it was gonna be colored okay you see this is gonna overflow I need a bigger bowl for sure this glue's so different it's like it kind of looks like a laundry detergent or something I feel like it's less thick we're gonna add some pink to this okay do you guys see this what kind of ripoff? Okay, I know this was a dollar, but like, how am I supposed to use this? I am so annoyed. Like, literally every single one of these is empty. So I'm gonna go ahead and use my food coloring. This paint did not work at all. I saw my friend Abraham. He actually was able to find these paints, these acrylic paints at the Dollar Tree. Now let's go in with some Tide. I've never used this actually like as an activator, so I hope it works good. Ooh, it's working. All right, let's get our hands in there. Start kneading a little bit. Okay, you guys, this is the best that I can get it right here. Uh, I feel like it's a little sticky, but the thing is, I activated it so much. But I mean, for everything to be a dollar, I think it's pretty amazing. It's very clicky, though. I like that. Ooh. 
fluffy slime. Oh, let's make some slime with this. I want to make something clear. This is the closest it's going to get to it. All right, we're going to try to activate this with some wick, some air wick, and this is Hawaii. So apparently air wick has whatever it is, sodium borate or whatever it is, that turns glue into slime. Oh, is it working? I honestly can't really tell at all. I don't think it is. And does it only work with a certain glue or what? Ugh. Okay, you know what? No. Let's go back to the Tide. What the heck is going on? This is literally breaking into pieces. The air wig and the Tide combined doesn't work. Let's try this again with another color. Let's try it with this. Why do I feel like it just crumbles up? It's literally turning into liquid. Okay, whatever this is does not work at all. So I guess clear slime is out the window. We're gonna have to do it with some white glue. You know what, we're gonna make a different type of crunchy-ish slime with some, with some beads. This literally looks like stock glue. That's a lot of food coloring, oopsie. Let's try a different uh, scent. This is cherry blossom. I really hope this works. What the heck is going on? Okay. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? I've seen Airwick on clear Elmer's glue. Is that like the only thing it works on? Or does it actually work on white glue too? It's not really doing much right now. It's literally not doing anything. So let's go back in with our Tide. Okay, you see, there you go. The Tide works. Okay guys, tad bit sticky, but it's kind of good because we're gonna add our beads. Let's go in with, I like the small ones. But also I kind of want some like jumbo ones in there, like a mix, but I'm mostly small. We're gonna go in with some baby oil just to soften it up a bit. Let's make some butter slime using this air dry clay. It's called Dough Craft Dough Fun. Activate it. It's time to go in with our Play-Doh like thingy. I feel like it's gonna melt it, I don't know why. Okay, it's so stiff. Uh oh, I don't know, it's like making it so stiff. Let's go in with some lotion. Soften it up a little bit. Okay, okay now, okay. It's literally melting on me. <gasps> you guys, send help. Activator, come through. Um, awkward. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is so bad. Yeah, this one's, this one's like definitely done. We're gonna go in with a silly string for this one. I feel like it would give it like a fluffy texture or something. Ooh, it's like, okay, I feel like this is gonna be interesting. I don't know, I feel like this would be kinda cool. They're starting to melt a little bit, but will they mix in? Oh, snap, that's a lot. Okay, you know what, we're gonna go in with our hands. I got my hands so messy, it looks like kinda like little sprinkles, it's so weird, I like it. I actually really like this one. And it's actually really stretchy. I think there's something in the string that actually makes it like this because I feel like the other ones were not as stretchy as this one. I really like how that looks though. Let's add some scent to this. I got cherry and I got apple. I'm feeling cherry scent for this even if it's green. I love cherry scent, so let's do cherry. You guys, cherry scent is the most, I, that's like my favorite. Okay, I've added a lot. 
Oh my gosh, I added a lot. Cherry scent is my favorite hands down. It smells like candy cherry and it looks so pretty. Ooh. <laughs> that was terrible. Oh, that smells so good. I love the sprinkle looking things. You guys, this is so cool. Has anybody done this before? This looks really cool. All right, you guys, so on to the next one. I already got my batch going right here. You guys already saw how that was done. It's basically just the glue and the Tide. And now we're gonna go in with some add-ins. I think we should make a super crunchy slime. I'm also gonna go in with these uh, little rubber bands, kind of like the loom band slime. <gasps> oh snap, that just popped open. <laughs> <gasps> this is amazing. I wish I can put this in clear slime so bad because it's so pretty. It doesn't look as pretty because, you know, it's not clear. That's cool. Okay, candle slime time. I'm so excited about these Skittles. The fact that Dollar Tree has Skittles candles, like I'm shook. I got strawberry, I got blueberry, and I got cherry. So we're gonna go ahead and melt these and then we're gonna turn them into slime. Got my melted candle. This one's cherry, it smells so good. We're gonna pour it in here. Oh my gosh, this smells so freaking good, you guys. It smells delicious. And then it starts to like stiffen a tiny bit. And when I first made this, everybody told me I did it wrong, that it's not supposed to like clump up but every other slime video that I've seen uh, it also clumps up on them so I feel like I did do it right I think that's supposed to happen wow this smells amazing Hey, here it is. I feel like my candle slime never comes out that great. I'm not sure if it's supposed to completely like be dissolved. I don't know, but this is what my candle slime comes out like. I also made strawberry and blueberry. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my gosh, should we do a swirl? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, what am I what did I do? Did I ruin this? Let's hope I didn't ruin it. So this is Amazing. It smells like skills right now and look at this. I that is so ugly. Oh my gosh, my favorite right here. Alright, now we're gonna take some diapers. We're gonna try to make a cloud slime with this. We're gonna cut this open down the middle. And there it is. This is basically super absorbent polymer. So we're gonna try to dissolve this into little bits. Not dissolve it, crumble it up into little bits. Let's add a little bit of water to it. Let's do it. Oh. Take it apart as much as I can. I think this is the most it's gonna get down to what I wanted to. We have our slime right here made. We're gonna start adding it in. Okay. It's definitely becoming the texture of like the cloud ones. I feel like it does kind of have the cloud um, consistency kind of. I hope you guys can see it. I think it's pretty cool. I wouldn't say it's exactly a cloud slime, but this is the most that I can get it with a diaper, which is actually pretty good. To be a diaper, it's pretty amazing. 
And that is it for Dollar Tree slime. I'm still pretty shook. Dollar Tree, like literally everything from Dollar Tree, I am pretty amazed. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment down below what was your favorite slime. For everything to be a dollar, these were pretty bomb. You'll be surprised, Dollar Tree literally has everything, especially right now that like the holidays are coming up. They're stocking up with Christmas stuff, which means like all these little cute add-ins, all these styrofoam maids and everything because the holidays are coming up. Comment down below which one was your favorite slime. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.